I'm going to talk about clipping extensions. You guys know, I don't want to call myself the queen of clipping extensions because I'm not, but that's pretty much what my, my channel is kind of known for when it comes to extensions or fake hair or you want to know, like if you want to call it that. Um, I really don't do wigs or weaves or anything like that. My favorite snack of choice is clipping extensions. And so um, when I was approached by Perfect Locks to do this video, I was like, okay, let me go on their website and see what they're working with, you know, girlfriend? Because, you know, it kind of gets, you know, like repetitive when you just keep talking about clipping extensions all the time. So I went on their website and I saw this unique set of clipping extensions and I was like, oh yeah, I gotta talk about this. So I picked these out and I want you guys to see them. Now, if I have not said it before, uh, the company is called Perfect Locks. And before I get into the hair and everything, I want you guys to see my hair. No, I'm not wearing the clipping extensions right now. I'm wearing my own hair. So you know how we do we usually do these videos where you see the after and the beginning, and then we take you through it. No, I'm gonna show you from the beginning. So this is my hair now. Um, I actually curled it with my um, Numi wand. So this is it right here. You know, just the little curls. Do, 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 do. I lock these curls in with my healthy sexy hair soy hairspray girlfriend uh, I will show you the tools at the end because they're out there so I'll show you the tools that I use now I just want to show you the clip-ins this is what you will get and you're like I just get one track of clip-ins yes girlfriend you tell me you're not getting one track you're getting about one two three four five six seven eight let me see one two three four five six seven eight nine every time i count it i'm going up a number one two three four five six seven eight nine yeah nine so you're getting nine tracks and um you're like well why are you only holding up one girlfriend i'm holding up all nine at the same time look at that look at that and you're like dang they weft them all together they sold it all together and this is called a volumizer so it's like putting in your clip-ins all at one time. If you want to know how to just be out the door real quick, girlfriend, you don't want to have to be parting and clipping, parting and clipping, or parting and teasing and clipping, or like I usually do, I corn roll before I do it. All you need is this if you don't want to have to go through all that hassle. You just need this. So um, the size of this is 16 inches. So as you can see, this is considered the wavy. Do, do, do. As you can see here, this is considered the wavy, although I did curl this with my uh, flat iron. Um, and I also want to let you know that I did wash these before I wore them. They, it did come with like an instruction, a care card, and it said wash them when you first get them. So when I first took it out the package, it was a little, I want to say shiny, but it wasn't like Barbie doll hair. It wasn't shiny like that. But it had a sheen to it. You know, like when you get hair freshly out the pack, it got a sheen to it. So I wanted it to look more real and not extension looking, you know? So I want to show you guys how I did this, how I installed this in my hair really quickly. You don't need to braid your hair. You don't need to twist your hair or anything. You really don't even need to tease. But if your hair is very, very fine, you may want to tease just to have that insurance policy that ain't going to slide out. But it's pretty much not going to slide out. So let's get started girlfriend we are going to do this in real time let's see what time it is so i'm going to see how long this takes hold on i am going to do my stopwatch i don't know if you guys could see that that looks crazy but yeah i'm gonna do my stopwatch so we are going to start it right now okay so what you want to do is you want to go from your ears like right above your ear and just take your finger you don't need a comb for this oh uh, you pretty much really don't even need a mirror but you're going to part right like that and then you're going to take your clip or whatever to get your hair out the way, girlfriends. Woo, looking crazy. So you have this right here. So you have half up, half down. Meow. Now you want to make sure you take all of these clips out. There's four clips. One, two, three, four. And then there's two on the bottom. So there's six all together. The first ones we are going to do are the four clips. Make sure you unclip all of them before you start this. Then you want to take the little clips on the end and make sure they come to like not on your ear because you want to have a little bit of edges like um there and your hair start a little further back but just clip it you know y'all get the idea like right there after you do that you want to clip the other two 
from the top. So now I have all four, is that one down? Yeah, I have all four clips on now. Then you want to take your hand under, find those two clips, pull this down, and then just clip right over your hair. You don't have to go under your hair, just go right over it. Just like that, girlfriend. And then you want to take this down like this. Doo -doo -doo. And then you want to make sure your hair is covering the tracks. And voila. And let's see. Stop. It took me 1 minute and 27 seconds. I don't know if you can see that. Dang, it sucks. This thing is so light. Can you see that, girlfriend? That's how long it took to install it. Now you can just play with it, you know, like make sure your real hair is covering it, making it look all good and everything, girlfriend. Don't want no track showing, girlfriend. Let me look in my mirror down here. Now, I suggest, me personally, if you want to, you can curl, you could make sure the hair extensions are straight and your hair is straight and then curl it together. Me personally, I like to curl my hair first and then curl the clip-ins and then put them in. So curl your own hair by itself, curl the clip-ins by itself and then put it in because that's less pulling on your hair, you know? Like just living your life, they're not pulling, but if you gotta if you're curling it with a flat iron, you're pulling, you know, you don't you don't want to put too much tension and stress on your hair. So there you go, girlfriend. Look at that. look at that. That was so quick. So when I saw this hair on um, Perfect Locks, y'all know I had to share this with y'all. I couldn't be holding a secret. This is the little packaging that it comes with. Ain't that cute? So your hair will come in this little package like this, looking all pretty. And y'all know my favorite color is purple. If you don't know, now you do. But let me show you the side. Do, do, do. See that, girlfriend? Show you this side. And then, let me show you the back, girlfriend. Now, I know you're wondering, well, is this going to slide out? Am I going to be looking crazy up in these streets? <laughs> no. I've worn these quite a bit of times. And, um, because I've had this for a while. But I wanted to, you know, like, play with it. I didn't want to, like, wear it and then go outside and look like I'm crazy and things fly down the street. And then look like a rat floating in the air. I wanted to try it for a while. Make sure I like it. And then I want to show you guys. So, it's not going to fall out. Um, unless you don't snap the clips and if you just stick the comb in there like the clips in there and you don't like clip them of course it's gonna fall out if you put them in that clip you're fine you have six clips that are hanging in your hair you can do this under two minutes your clip ends under two minutes i know you're like well this video is longer than two minutes yeah but y'all know i like to make long videos because i talk too much on my hair i used my new meat 25 millimeter curling wand this is what i use right here to curl my hair. Then on the clipping extensions, I use my QT Performance Hair Styling Flat Iron. Right there. And I know you're like, well, why did you use different with, with different hair? It's because I don't have the technique down with curling with my flat iron on the right side of my head. The left side, I got it, girl. I got it down. It'd be looking good. But then when I get to the right side, it's like twisting like this, and I gotta keep going doing it and doing it like that. And that's not good doing that over and over again, putting too much heat on your hair. But with this, I could do this one time with each strand. Maybe two if I'm feeling a little special. But um, I only have to do that one time. And then it was easier since the clippings aren't attached to anything. It was just attached to a hanger. It's easier to use the flat iron. But the curls came out the same. I didn't have to worry about pulling on it after. This gives you that voluminous greatness. And I just love how it blends it with my hair, girlfriend. So just to give you the specs again, which I will put right here, hmm. um, this is from Perfect Locks and you know I got my cheat sheet down here and I have the wavy clip and volumizer, it's virgin hair and a 1B is the color that I got and this is 16 inches. Now I do want to let you know that when I got it, it had, the ends were a little wispy so it wasn't like thick from top all the way down to the bottom, it had little wispy ends like to make it look natural but I kind of didn't like that, so I cut like this much off. 
and I just went in with the scissors like this. I didn't do it bluntly like that. I just went in with the scissors like that to cut too much of the wispiness off. So this is what the ends look like. See? Do, 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 do. See? Not blunt or anything. It looks more more natural and not so wispy like. But uh, um, but pretty much you still you're still looking at 16 inches. Maybe you're looking at 15 right now. And I just absolutely love it. I don't feel a whole bunch of weight on my head. Um, it's so easy and then you don't have too many clippings to like try to like feel for I'd be like okay you you know how sometimes you got a clip down here and you're like oh did a clip fall out Whew, no it's still there no here you just go and you know the clip's still there because it's just one clipping extension but I don't want to ramble too long any information that I forgot to put in this video I'll leave down in the description box below please check the description box for more information when I don't film for a while, I feel a little odd or a little awkward. But I love you guys and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If there's any questions that you have about the hair, about my hair, whatever, just, you know, to do, leave the comments down there, girl. So I'll see you guys next time. Have a great day. Bye. To Lou. Round. Round. Thinking about. Thinking about keeping this background like this, I know it looks bland. It's almost like the same color as my face or whatever, so it's kind of odd. I'm thinking about painting this wall white because Mama seems to have her toys all over the place, and it's like I gotta spend like decades clean in the living room just to film, and it just feels odd. My background now, cause it's not centered like it used to. I'm just, and I'm not inspired. So we might be doing a white wall or a black wall. Let me know in the comments below. You like to see all white wall or black wall. But it's gonna be one solid color. But I like just turn the camera on and just film.